What's up guys, Trader Toll. Today we're gonna to talk about max battles, these giant Dynamax battles. This is a clip that GameSpot posted up. They're going to fight a Dynamaxed Steelix, the size of an office building, absolutely insane. Requires a full group to complete. So you can see, this is the team that he's bringing. He's got his Lucario ready to go. So he's selecting and he's bringing into the team. And you can see his friends there, Tom, Jane, and Gloria, and what they're bringing as well. So Togekiss, obviously that defensive Pokemon, that healing Pokemon. Let's see how this goes. What I love about the Dynamax system, I, I come from MMOs. I come from World of Warcraft. I come from Star Wars Old Republic, where you need a tank, you need a healer, you need damage dealers. That's the whole idea here, right? And so finally, in the Pokemon series, this is a team of four people who all are bringing their best Pokemon. You can see he's charging that max gauge so that he can Dynamax his own Pokemon to do a ton of damage. You know, uh, what, what we might call popping their ultimate in other games. You can see here they are selecting the moves that are going to be used. Each player in that, that turn-based system is selecting the move that they're gonna be using. You can see that the system is waiting for them. It's communicating online so that it's receiving uh, what each step is going to be. A wonderful system for that turn-based. Hopefully you're not sitting there for too long going, go already, push the damn button. But I think there'll be a little bit of that just based on this video. Connecting, waiting for input, waiting for move. Push the button, push the damn button. Oh, it's on now. You can see he's popping that Dynamax gauge. He's using the Pokeball gets absolutely huge and Dynamaxed Arcanine joins the fight. Look at that thing. Again, just the same size as Steelix, the size of an office building, and he's gonna unleash his insane max power, max flare. And look at the amount of damage, like like probably 20, 25% of the, uh, the raid boss health taken out in that one max move. That is really cool. It is kind of funny to see a little Ludicolo up there shaking it, trying to attack that giant Steelix. Stat boosts both debuffs on the Dynamax Pokemon and buffs on yourself are more important in Pokemon Sword and Shield than they have ever been before. It, you know, growl and things like that that reduce the enemy's attack value. We often skipped them. We went straight to tackle, right? But now, because the battle is going to last so long, we really want to apply those poison effects, those stat reducing effects, so that we have a better chance of surviving this miserably long battle. Tom's Arcanine again using that max flare ability, completely chewing through Steelix's remaining health. And there he goes. Steelix is weak, and you can actually catch the Dynamax Pokemon after the raid. Really, really cool. Uh, I'm, I'm super excited at the prospect of playing with other people. We stream Monday, Wednesday, Friday, 7 to 9 on twitch.tv slash trainer toll. And if you like this video, throw us a like, throw us a subscribe, and we'll see you next time. Ooh, he got it.